Hey everyone, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. So today is another plan with me as scheduled. Um, you'll notice a couple of changes. Number one, I'm in a new cover, <clears throat> and I will do a detailed flip of this cover. I'll just show it to you really quickly. I actually bought this um, pre-loved, and it is a Think Thank K cover. Um, it's undyed. It smells so good. Oh my goodness. And I got it from Hannah, um, who owns Caffeine and Paper Co. I bought it off of a D stash that she had, but it is such a beautiful cover. It's already got like some patina. It's a little bit, oh, it's so soft and squishy. It's just all the goodness. So I, I moved all of my like actual inserts into this, um, this morning. So it's, it's May the 1st right now, so it's the first day of May, and um, I do like to change up um, covers or setups or deco and things like that the first of the month, but um, <clears throat> I moved all of my inserts in here. There is absolutely no decoration in here except for what's in my pocket, so this is like my bare bones planner, so I'm just still working on it, and once I finish it, I will definitely show you guys the flip. But today we're doing our weekly plan with me. <clears throat> so this is the weekly I used last week from Plan With B. I really, really like this weekly. It's amazing. But I have an itch to try something different. And I actually downloaded um, this insert from Paper Test Designs. And I'll flip through it really quickly. Um, this is the weekly agenda. Um, I actually downloaded this probably a month ago with the intention of using it in May because the month of May is going to be really, really busy. Um, so it's, you get this cover sheet when you purchase the insert and then you get week on two pages here and then you just kind of, I punched these wrong. Oh my heavens, look at that. <clears throat> and then you just get these inserts through here and then the back has this weekly list. That's the back of the insert and then this is the front. So it's almost like a little booklet. So I'm gonna try these out. I'm gonna commit to them for at least two weeks. So I'm just gonna pull these bad boys off. Make sure I am in frame so that you can see everything nice and clear. So this week is a busy week. May is going to be a very busy month. So I have a lot of things going on. We have a lot of appointments. We have lots of like end of school things for our children. Um, I start graduate school. So just like a lot of like busyness happening this week. Um, so let's start first with, I need my deco stickers. Number one, <clears throat> I set, I set those right there. Let's start first with how I'm planning to use this insert. So I've decided that I lately I've been feeling like really exhausted and run down. So I've decided that I'm gonna use the daily tracker to track my sleep. Cause I wanna see, I wanna make sure I'm getting enough sleep. I don't think I am. I'll use this section for our meals, <clears throat> excuse me. And then I will use this section for my weekly workouts. And then of course these are for day specific tasks. And then I will use these for things I need to clean around the house. Um, and then this box will be where my weekly affirmation lives. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do obviously is I'm going to write in the dates. So we're looking at May 3rd through the 9th. So I'm just gonna quickly write in the dates as a quick reference. Now we also know in this week we have Mother's Day um, and then my typical like standard task. I don't have a ton of appointments going on this week, thank goodness, for that. And then of course I will go with my affirmation for the week. So the first thing I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and fill in like these, the daily schedule things. My schedules don't really change. So I'm just going to like fill in what is going on. Um, so I work now... I work about 7.30 to 3.30. I'm just gonna do eight to three on here. And I'm just going to write work in each of these columns. Except for Friday, because I don't, I'm not gonna work on Friday because I have some um, something and I'm using PTO. 
So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna track my sleep. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna count it down absolutely hours. So I'm just gonna write eight hours, seven hours, and obviously so on and so forth. I saw someone on Instagram do this and I was like, that's a really good idea. I can't remember who it was or I would give them credit. And then I'm gonna put less than four hours. And this will give me an idea of like what is happening. So this will give me an idea of like why I'm feeling tired. Like, am I not sleeping well? So while I'm on this side, I'm gonna go ahead and schedule my workouts. And I like, you know, you guys know me, I like to highlight. I'm gonna go ahead and schedule my workouts and list out our meal plans. And I actually think I'm gonna put our meal plans here and my workouts there so as I do them, I can check them off. So I'm gonna put meal meals and then I'm gonna do workouts here. So Monday is cardio. Wednesday is weights. Thursday is yoga. And Saturday is, I'm gonna put cardio instead of walk. Last weekend we played tennis and it's still, <laughs> that's still a good workout. So um, I'm just gonna put cardio again. And then I'm gonna pull out obviously my pocket planner. And I've already grocery shopped and did really good this week. I was on it with the meal plan. Our meal plan is very simple because it's been really hard like coming home during the week and cooking because work has been so busy. So <clears throat> we're having the easiest meal plan I could think of because it's the last three weeks of school. And at this point I am in survival mode. Um, I'm just really exhausted. And then Wednesday we're gonna do breakfast. And then Thursday I decided on sandwiches. Yeah, like I said, simple. And then Friday is date night. Boom, so that is done. All right, so Monday, and I'm going to highlight this time here, and then Tuesday, I'm going to highlight that time there. And again, I'm using the Tombow 942. This is my workhorse um, Tombow marker, <clears throat> and this is tennis lessons, tennis, and tennis here. And then Thursday, we have a parent-teacher conference, so I'm just going to highlight it 3 o'clock here, and I'm just going to put school, so that way I know that's where I'm supposed to be. And I don't know if this insert is going to function well for me. It looks like it will, um, so I'm just, like I said, just going to try it out. So I think that's pretty much, I'm gonna double check. Oh, and then I have grad school orientation on Friday. But um, I'm trying to think like how I'm gonna mark that on this schedule. I just think I'm gonna, um, I think what I'm gonna do is, it's, it's supposed to be eight to five. So I am going to just draw a line here and I'm gonna write in sideways orientation. That way I know, and that's okay. All right, so I think that's it. Yeah, so I think that that is it for how I wanna use this schedule. I don't know what I wanna put here, so I'm just gonna leave it for now. Coffee time, okay. So here is where I'm going to list out like appointments. So I don't feel like I need to put like tennis lessons there because I already know like it's it's becoming a part of our routine. But I feel like I need to note for Thursday my daughter's parent teacher conference. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull all my stickers that I have here. Um, and I wanted to use some of my squares because I haven't used these and I have like a ton of these. So these are from Sweet Caress Designs, and I think I'm gonna go, I like this color. <clears throat> so, I think I'm gonna use this color here. 
for Thursday. I'm just going to stick it here. Um, 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 yep. Sorry. <laughs> it's going to stick it there. All right, the dark this is going to contrast well with those. And I'm going to write out, that's at 3.05. Here at teacher conference. Okay. <clears throat> and then here I need to, I want to note my grad school orientation. So to keep with cohesion here, I'm going to use the same sticker. Look at how easy I got that off today. Y'all know I struggle. So I'm just going to put it here because that is a day specific task or a grad school orientation. And it's, um, it's virtual from eight to five. I'm like, Ooh, that's a long time. My heavens, that is a long, long time. <clears throat> and then, so what I want to, and I may not use like my icon sticker for laundry day this week because of Mother's Day. So I want to use this sticker here from CZQ Plans. And I make, you know, again, I have these columns here too. So I think I'm going to put this, look at that. It fits great. And I'm just going to put Happy Mother's Day. Perfection. Great. I'm loving the way this is looking, by the way. Okay, so then for my to-dos um, for the week, I'm making sure that there is nothing else on my planner. I'm checking both of my calendars just to make sure I have everything covered. Okay, so I think that's all of my day-specific things that I have going on. So the next thing that I want to list out is... Are basically like the tasks that I complete every single basically every single week so Friday my parents are getting my children so it's date night so I'm going to use these cute little heart stickers from Cat Espresso Co and I think I'm gonna lay it here under my orientation I think that's cute Okay. And I'm going to put date night. Okay. So Monday and Tuesday is looking, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday is looking pretty bare. <laughs> I'm kind of glad. Okay. So then I think all I'm going to do here is I'm going to lay down a budget sticker for Thursday in this to do column. And I think that's like the only to do that I'll have that I won't need to put on my dailies. Um, so I'm just gonna do some layering here. And that, and I'm gonna use, I'm sorry, that was a, I guess I should show you, Sweet Caress and the Color Wonder. And then I have my Scripts by LNC budget stickers. So I'm gonna pull these off and you do have to be careful with these. All right, so I'm gonna put budget. Okay, and then Friday is payday, so I do want that to stand out to me as well. So, back to the Wonder Stickers. I don't know where I'm putting my hand. Back to the Wonder Stickers from Scripps by LNC, and then payday stickers from Caffeine and Paper Co. Is let's see. So Saturday is always groceries. I think I'm not going to use stickers for that. I feel like I'm putting a lot of stickers on here. So I'm gonna change something, I'm gonna change it up for this week and I'm just going to write, for Saturday, I'm gonna write meal plan. 
under my to do's grocery shop. And Sunday, I'm going to do laundry day. All right. So the bottom, <laughs> the end of my week looks really busy, whereas the top half of my week is not looking so busy, and I'm okay with that. Um, so we have that going on. The last, well, no, not the last thing, but I do want to list out the things I want cleaned. So I think what I'm going to do is I have these stickers from Planner Fluent. I think these are her old ones. I think she like thinned them out a bit. Um, but I'm going to lay this sticker here. And I'm going to, let's see, I always vacuum. Oh, I forgot to see. Oh, my heavens. Vacuum. Um, I'm trying to look. Like, what are my chores? <laughs> um, a laundry. Kitchen. And then I think I, I need to dust. And I need to mop. Oop. And my pen is skipping. Sorry. Okay. So my pen was skipping. I had to stop for a minute and get a new one because that was bugging me. So mop. Okay. And then I think I need to set my priority list has been very helpful. Um, it's helped me like if you look at last week, it, like I got two of the three things done and that's good in my opinion. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this box to set my priorities. So I'm just going to number them. So I think one is, um, I have to finish like these, um, pre-orientation, um, assignments. So I'm going to put complete pre-orientation. Um, two, I'm going to say finish my setup. Because if I have free time, I'm getting it done. And then three, I'm moving our plan the trip. Okay. <clears throat> I do want to upload, so I try to upload on Sundays and Wednesdays, so I do need to start like incorporating that. So I think what I'm going to do for Wednesday is I'm just going to write in upload. I feel like I need to start incorporating that into my weekly and Sunday. I'm going to do an upload. Um, so that way it's just kind of like in my face all week where I can see it because I do reference my weekly every single day. Okay, so lastly, I'm just going to pull out my affirmation list, and I have a few few new affirmations that I really want to write down. Um, so I'm going to use this one because I want to get in the mindset for grad school, in all honesty. So my affirmation this week is I give myself space to grow and learn. Um, that's that's it for me this week because like I said I start grad school I've got to get in the mindset I have not been in school I graduated in 2007 with my undergraduate degree and I have not attend, attended school since then so I'm using these Susie Q plans stickers so I am yeah I am not um as of yet I am not in that mindset and I need to get in that mindset. So I think that's a great affirmation for me to start the week. And every week, um, every Monday, I do add, um, I create a graphic and post it to my Instagram stories, which I always link down below on my Instagram handle. So if you wanted to get like my weekly affirmation as a um, screen saver for your phone, or I would show you guys, but I'm currently filming on my phone. Um, that's on my, that's on my stories every single Monday. And I also have a highlight on my profile that you can, that you guys can look at. So I'm just going to highlight, hopefully that's enough space. Oop. I do not know why that's skipping, but it is. And then I'm going to use 
these pretty florals from Suzy Q Plans to accent here. It's just become my vibe that I really, whoop, that I really like. I think it looks really good. So yeah, so far that's my week. Um, and like I said, if you look back at my weekly plan with me that I posted on Sunday and then look at what is actually on this now, I added a bunch of stuff. So this is just, my weekly is always like a work in progress and I'm constantly adding things to it. But as of right now, this is what I know of that's happening with my week. Um, not really sure how I'm feeling about this insert at the moment. So I'll just kind of wait and see how it goes. I'm going to commit to using it for two weeks. Um, and I may just have to reduce like my deco and things. I'm going to pop it back in. It looks really nice in the planner. So yeah, guys, that's my week. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you liked this video, please be sure to hit the like button. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you so much and I'll talk to you soon.